Welcome to our channel Tiny Thinkers. Let's learn about shapes today. First shape we are going to see is triangle. Triangle has three sides, one, two, three. Three corners A, B, C. The sum of all the angles of a triangle, of all types, is equal to 180 degrees. Second shape we are going to see is square. Square has all four sides, one, two, three, four, equal length and four corners, A, B, C, D. Sum of all the angles of square is 360 degrees. Next shape we are going to see is circle. A circle is a round shaped figure that has no corners or edges. All the points on the surface of the circle are equidistant from the center point P called radius. If we do one full turn, it's 360 degrees. Next shape we are going to see is pentagon. A pentagon has five sides, one, two, three, four, five, and five corners, A, B, C, D, E. Total angles of the pentagon is 540 degrees, 108 plus 108 plus 108 plus 108 plus 108. Next shape we are going to see is rectangle. A rectangle has four sides, one, two, three, four, and four corners, A, B, C, D, and sum of all angles of rectangle is 360 degrees. The opposite sides of a rectangle are equal and parallel. Next shape we are going to see is star. In geometry, a star shape, or a star polygon, is a type of non-convex polygon, and most commonly, a type of decagon. A concave decagon has 10 sides and two sets of five vertices. Next shape we are going to see is rhombus. The key difference between square and rhombus is square has all its angle equal to 90 degrees, but rhombus does not have. All sides are equal, and opposite sides are parallel to each other. Next shape we are going to see is oval. An oval is a smooth-looking closed curve shape. It has no vertices, corners, or any straight sides like a square, rectangle, or triangle. An oval shape does not have a common distance from the center, point P. That's all for now. Hope you had informative session on the basic shapes. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to our channel.